Um, in recognition of the incredible work that Pearl Space does each and every day, I have the great pleasure to announce that the Government of Canada has invested over $1 million from the National Co-Investment Fund to support Pearl's Place Transition House Expansion Project. We've also committed an additional $550,000 over the next six years to continue to support this amazing organization and the work that they do. These renovations, or with the funding, renovations have provided an additional three beds plus a fully accessible auxiliary home with two beds, which includes a communal kitchen, laundry, and designated space to meet with crisis support staff privately 24 hours a day. And this project has gone above and beyond to not only ensure that the environment is safe and secure, but to make sure it's comfortable and feels like home for women, two-spirit, gender-diverse, non-binary, trans people, and the children who've experienced violence or have otherwise experienced unsafe living conditions. And this is part of the federal government's $88.4 million funding announcement through the Women and Children Shelter and Transition Housing Initiative to construct and repair 212 shelter beds and transitional homes across Canada for women and children fleeing violence. These kinds of investments are transformational for our communities. And today's announcement shows that our government determination to improve housing conditions for women and children in Squamish and right across the country.